I don't know about you guys, but I have chills tonight. I've been waiting for this moment for a long, long time, as has the WWE Universe. Finally, things are going to get settled. My goosebumps have goosebumps, and if yours don't, you better check your pulse. Look into this card. I just got to rub my hands together and smile. Singles match coming up next. Just wait for what's up next. There's no telling what's going to happen in a battle like this. We have one of our breakout talents against an imposing adversary. an extreme rules match making his way to the ring from birmingham england weighing in at 205 pounds the wwe united kingdom champion pete dunn From Sandy, Utah, weighing in at 220 pounds, the hardcore icon. What a great match we have here to start off this night, guys. And, Michael, I had to check twice when I saw this match listed as our opener. I mean, it could very well have been our main event. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Settle in, guys. This is going to be a blast to watch. Nice.
hooked up. Oh, man, what a driver. Oh, what a slam. He's on the defensive here, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark my words. Power bomb! What's up, running bulldog? Oh, there's the old stump pulling uh, leg snap. Uh, that's going to hurt. Tear your hamstring. Bringing it back into the ring. Oof. I say every superstar remembers their first match on Raw, but for Pete Dunbyron, his first match has a little extra special meaning as it took place in his home country of England. Well, not only that, Michael, but Pete Dunn also walked away from that match with a decisive victory over the WWE Cruiserweight Champion at the time. Pretty impressive, if you ask me. We already established that Pete Dunne was successful in his first Raw match, but to me, the biggest takeaway from that was that the 23-year-old didn't exhibit an ounce of nervousness in front of a sellout crowd of nearly 15,000 in his home country on a big show like Monday Night Raw. That's because Dunne oozes confidence. He was dominant that night because he knows it's just a matter of time before he'll be back on Raw and in the main event, most likely. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Nobody oh, controls man. the pace of a match quite like this guy. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be... He's looking at it. Nailed it. Here's a chance to win this. Done. Great one on oh, and the ladder finds the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back from that one. What's this? Big slam. Get over the physicality of this match. It has been absolutely brutal. He's taking some offense. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Cole. This is just a little bump in the road for him here. Nothing to worry about. This could be trouble, guys. His opponent has finally found an opening, and he doesn't look too eager to relinquish it. WWE made history in 2017 with a tournament to crown the inaugural United Kingdom champion, which I was lucky enough to call in person. And in that tournament, this man, Pete Dunne, emerged as the next can't-miss superstar. Oh, no, we've got a problem here, guys. No kidding. Who knows what will happen next? Oh, 
Severe damage being inflicted to the back. I'd agree with what Michael was saying about Pete Dunne's performance in the UK Championship Tournament. If you didn't know him heading in, you sure as heck knew who he was coming out. I'll tell you one person who definitely knew who Pete Dunne was after coming out, and that's William Regal. Regal was absolutely irate after Dunne launched a pre-match attack on his second-round opponent. Without a doubt, this is a volatile situation, guys. WWE superstars are dangerous without weapons. Then you put them in an environment like this, and who knows what you're liable to see. Suplex. He's making a statement here with this attack. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Hard to argue Michael's point on volatility and the volatility of this match. But what I think oftentimes gets overlooked is the mental anguish that goes along with competing in a match like this. No, oh, boo-hoo, cry me a river, Saxton. These competitors knew exactly what they were getting themselves into when they chose this profession. Incredible! There was a lot of force behind that one. in trouble. Roll through. There he needs. Here's his moment, Michael. Guys, let's go to the replay. Yeah, I definitely need to see that again. We've got a cover. Kick out at two. Oh, that may have been a slow count. With all the damage done, you have to wonder how much more it'll take. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free for all will absolutely. Anything can happen. Whoa, the ladder hits. Jeez, that's gonna hurt. He wants no part of the outside. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is, Cole. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. Sometimes serious injury. Boy, from behind, rolls through. Oh, what impact. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Got him good there. Yeah, let's take another look. right here incoming Pete Dunne is all about the intimidation he's a man of few words but actions like holding that United Kingdom championship in his teeth as he glares at his competition down the ramp sends a message to his opposition. That, that message is, you're about to become the recipient of a pummeling courtesy of the Bruiserweight. This could be it. Beautiful technique. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Bringing back up Pete Dunne's penchant for intimidation, I'm fine with sending a message during his entrance, but his attacks before and after the bell rings just cross the line. I disagree, Saxton. While most of Dunne's United Kingdom Championship Tournament's opposition were excited for the opportunity and happy to be in front of an English crowd, the Bruiserweight showed everyone he wanted it more with those who would beat them.
Look at these two getting it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. No question about it, Cole. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open following a vicious attack. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, I don't think I've ever seen John Cena manhandled like he was on that night. Yeah, Lesnar definitely brought it to Cena that night. But what's truly amazing is that John Cena eventually found a way to win that match. He's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. See that again. Definitely worth a second look. Pete Dunn is all about the intimidation. He's a man of few words, but actions like holding that United Kingdom championship. In you can put this one in the bank. Let's take another look at these guys getting after it. I'm not easily impressed, but even I thought that match was one of the best I've seen in a while. These superstars gave as good as they got, and these fans got their money's worth from the opening bell. He's going to want to make sure he saves every minute of this match for his personal highlight reel, because he was on fire in this one. Here is your winner, the Hardcore Icon. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. It'll be tough for the next match to be as good, but we shall see. Get ready for some WWE magic. Buckle up because we have a contest that's going to blow the roof off this place. In a match that will be etched in the record books. This is going to be one to remember.
on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 1,280 pounds, the Sawyer and Death, the Undead. Byron, tell me, how do you think the champ looks heading into this one? I'm impressed, Michael. Sometimes you see a champion look a little less motivated when the title is not on the line. But that's clearly not the case here tonight. This is it. This is the match we've all been waiting for. And the electricity level in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt. champ's game plan differs, if at all, knowing that the title is not on the line here tonight. Boom, what impact! What a stop! Good grief! Slap jab! Boom! Chip-breaking uppercut! Oh my god, a close line! Look at He's definitely starting to lose it here. And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. Harsh impact. Looks like he's starting to tire. You can bet this is not how he drew this one up. Hey, while he might not want to hear it now, sometimes the big move coming. Wait for it. He's resilient, but he may not be doing himself any long-term favors by staying in this one. This might be the end of the line for him here in this tornado tag team match. I'm not, it might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. from that top turnbuckle. You gotta believe this one's over. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. Yeah, that truly was a thing of beauty. Landing. He's starting to stagger a bit. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. A striking blow. That'll break you in half. I think this is the beginning of the end. DDT got every ounce of that 
one. This could be over. What a slam, Michael. He goes for the cover. And he finds a way free. Wow. That was just pure determination, Cole. And he breaks the cover. Wow. Oh. <laughs> momentum here. taking this match as these highlights show. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire as these highlights show very well. I know the match was solidly entertaining, but I really hope these guys would take it to the next level. Regardless, nobody's asking for their money back. two here tonight. It's performances like the one we just saw from these guys that makes tag team wrestling so exciting. As usual, this Philadelphia crowd is beyond boisterous tonight. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. I can't wait to see how the rest of the card shakes out here. Get ready for action all over the building. It's finally time for the Falls Count Anywhere match.
The knockout artist. Cassius Ono's here. Making his way to the ring from Dayton, Ohio, weighing in at 260 pounds, Cassius Ono. Cash Zono, a true student of the game, constantly improving, traveling the world to better his craft. Cash is, is a dangerous man. And he's ready to go here tonight. journey around the world to bursting on the scene at NXT TakeOver Brooklyn 3. Adam Cole is finally on the big stage where he's wanted to be all along. And the mission statement has been very simple. Shock the system. Incredible athlete, incredible trash talker. It's not bragging if you can back it up. Adam Cole is here with one thought in mind to shock the system. Matches like this oh, rarely end inside the ring, which is what makes them so unpredictable. I don't know where Adam Cole gets the nerve into thinking he can come in and take what he wants. Saxton, he doesn't just want to take everything. Adam Cole wants to rule the entire industry. Beautiful dive. Oh, nasty impact. Oh, man, what a boot. He's starting to feel it here. To be expected, though, it's not like he's in there with a the slouch, guys. He obviously came into this match intent Ouch. on taking the fight to the outside as much as he could. Though I'm not sure that's the right approach. Perhaps he has dinner plans oh, to man. get to. I don't know. There has to be some reason for him showing next to no offense here tonight. The shoulders down. An easy kick out for Adam Cole. Not yet. <laughs> oh, man. What are we going to see here? Torture your opponent's neck. I like it. Guys, the most important thing for a superstar to remember in a Falls Count Anywhere match is that anything goes. And I do mean anything. I hope someone uses you as a weapon, Saxton. which means we're likely to see a liberal use of weaponry here tonight. Yeah, and keep in mind, Cole, the fact that there's no disqualification also means that anybody can interfere and there's nothing you can do about it. Ooh, right 
the face destroyed. He's stumbling some now. He can't be happy with how this is going right now. This might be it. Oh, my. And Cassius Odo slips out of harm's way. You've got to believe this one's over. One of the most talked about events in NXT history was when Adam Cole and his undisputed era teammates shocked the sports entertainment world and appeared at the third annual NXT TakeOver Brooklyn. Universe at the Barclays Center responded. They knew NXT would never be the same. Oh, give me a break. You two are so melodramatic. Adam Cole simply picked the best time to let the NXT Universe know that things were going to change. Personally, I commend it. In case we have any newbies watching, a false count anywhere match means that this contest can literally end anywhere. Simple, right? Even Saxton can understand those rules. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. On the shoulders here. And it could be a long way down from there. Ooh, right to the back. In describing this match, Corey, you said it can end anywhere, which means we could see this match conclude in the ring, the stands, the locker room. Heck, it could even end outside the streets. And on top of that, it's worth noting that anything is legal in this match, guys. The only rule is there are oh no. rolling elbow from Cassius. Game, set, match. This one is oh, He's got him covered. One, two, and he got a near fall out of it. Wow. That's pure power, guys. There can only be one top dog here in the WWE, and a win here will go a long way in solidifying one of these guys' claims of being the best in the business. Whack! Michael, that gives you meaning to have a seat. Big punch by the top. Thanks for watching, everyone. Kick back, relax, and enjoy your Monday night with some great WWE action. Whack! Michael, it gives new meaning to have a seat. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. He's not looking like himself here. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out battle. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body of his. I wouldn't look too much into this right now. The good news for him is that his opponent's offense is likely packing a little less of a punch, considering all the damage he was able to inflict earlier in this match. Well, guys, the referee should have it relatively easy here tonight because, as you know, in a false count anywhere match, anything goes. Wow. Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Oh, he 
turns it around. Hard to argue your take on this match, Michael. When there are the rules to enforce, the official sole responsibility on a match like this is to simply declare the... Oh, no. I'm afraid so, Cole. This is going to be great. Thank you for choosing to watch WWE on this Monday night. We promise to bring you a great night of action. Whack! Michael, that gives me meaning to have a seat. As you turn the features clean off your face. Whack! Michael, that gives me meaning to have a seat. Gives new meaning to have a seat. For more than 20 years, Monday night has been the premier night in all of sports entertainment. And you can bet tonight will surely live up to the lofty standards. Boom! Buenas noches. Here's his moment, Michael. Catch us up. The cover, and this one's history. What a win. We always expect the unexpected in Falls County kind of newer matches, and that's what we got here, guys. Overall, this match was average at best, but not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, I've almost forgotten it happened already. No doubt about it, he brought his A game, as you can see here. Here is your winner, Cassius Ono. This was a much needed win. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us. The rest of the card should be every bit as good as the last match, too. It's about to get extreme up in here. Lock the doors. The Hide your kids. The Hide lunatic your wife. Fringe is in the house. Making his way to the ring. 
from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 225 pounds, the ultraviolet world heavyweight champion, Dean Ambrose, champion. Sure, this guy's fit to be tied, but his resume speaks for itself. The guy may sleep in a bedroom with padded walls, but one thing is undeniable. When Ambrose steps inside the ring, he is dangerous and one of the best in recent history. in the house and his opponent first from philadelphia pennsylvania weighing in at 193 pounds the cruiserweight champion at least he didn't bring that silly powerpoint Drew presentation Black. with him all right those powerpoint champion. presentations are highly educational you could stand to learn a thing or two from drew gulak has he ever cornered you in the locker room area once yeah, he got me too most miserable experience of my life. No doubt, though, that he can get it done in the ring. And from Baltimore, Maryland, weighing in at 208 pounds, the Zone Television Champion, Rusekis Champion. But Byron, does the fact that this is not a title match change the champ's game plan here? I don't think so, Michael. If I know him, he sees this match as just another opportunity to prove he is the most dominant force in all of the WWE. Are you at all surprised by the intensity level inside this arena right now? Not in the least bit, Michael. This is the one the WWE Universe has been looking forward to for quite some time. It's the 24-year-old piece of gold. And from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 160 pounds, Leo Rush. Byron, don't let this small package fool you. It may not be the biggest dog in the yard, but he's got the loudest bark. Leo Rush is the real deal. Look, I'm proud to give Leo Rush his just due. He, one of the most innovative superstars we've seen in a very long time. In fact, he is uh, coined 205 Live, Leo 5 Live.
And look at back suplex. Ooh. Very nice. Hooked up. What a driver. Watch out. Buddy pulled down. What's this? Driver! Ooh. He's starting to show signs of fatigue, but he's not appearing too worse for wear. At least not yet anyway. Ouch. Yeah, but he's got a very untraditional approach tonight, which includes spending a great deal of time outside the ring. That might help him in the long run. We'll see. Inverted power slam! That's gonna hurt. Harsh impact. Back now inside the ring. I'll tell you, watching Extreme Rules matches make me happy. My in-ring days are behind me. You talk about a treacherous environment to compete in. Ooh, what impact. This is a treacherous match indeed, as Corey was saying. I can't even tell you how many... Leg is hooked. Here we go. Perfect flex. He's looking good now, guys. That slam just brought this entire arena to its feet. Face first. this match, I'm definitely seeing similarities to the May 2016 Extreme Rules match. Oh, and he breaks free! But the damage might have already been done, Michael. Goes down hard. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. How much more punishment needs to be dished out? Just finish it! It's about as bad as it gets for him. When it comes to brutality, I would agree with Michael Cole's assessment that this match shares similarities with the 2016. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Yeah, it's going to take more than that to keep him down. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. Here it comes. He's got him. I don't think he should get up. Dodges a bullet there. 
vicious strike. He's looking a little weary here. I don't think this is how he envisioned this match going here tonight. Oh boy, he is rolling. Whoa, the Southern Light Suplex. You don't see that very often. That's what he was looking. He's going for the pin. And Drew Gulak is your winner. Now let's take another look at these guys in action. This match wasn't exactly a barn burner, but we can't expect every superstar to be on their A game every time, I guess. Remember this? Ain't nothing better than action like this. That was a big pinfall victory right there. All handed to Drew Gulak. His research and studies got him a win here tonight. As usual, this Philadelphia crowd is beyond boisterous tonight. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. I can't wait to see how the rest of the card shakes out here. All bets are off as we get extreme. Making her way to the ring from Pennsylvania, B. Tonga Kong. Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting superstars ready to square off here. And there's nothing quite like seeing two superstars settling it in the ring in one-on-one -on -one action, Michael.
and her opponent from England, XIA. One-on-one -on -one action coming up here, guys, and I'm willing to bet this will be one we won't soon forget. Totally agree, Michael. When you have two superstars as hungry as these two competing in the ring, you can bet it'll be memorable. And there's the bell, and here we go. This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. I don't know who's looking more forward to this, the women in the ring oh. or me. Using the elbow as a weapon. Oh, not the impact. Oh, incredible height. You gotta believe this one's over. Oh, 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 man! Ooh. Beautiful touch. She goes for the cover. She goes for the cover. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. She's still in this one. Nailed it. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never. Oh. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Regarding Corey's point about superstars having what it takes to get extreme i would argue that every superstar in the locker room possesses a mean streak yeah but not all mean streaks are created equal michael but i'd say there's only a select few who can turn their mean streaks all the way up to the most extreme level this might be big big elbow not looking good for her right now this is not at all where she hoped to be at this point in the match What an impactful STO. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Headbutt to the back of the neck. force behind that one. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Oh, oh, sweet. Nicely done. That's it. That's what she needed. Such incredible impact. talked to several people who think she's bitten off more than she can chew here. I can't say that I agree. Incredible! There was a lot of force behind that one. To the outside where she has all the time in the world to do what she needs to do. Whack! My 
Well, that gives new meaning to have a seat. She's looking at it. And a spinning sit out power bomb. Wow, she's fought her way all the way back here. What is keeping this competitor going? She's not done yet, but you have to believe that she's still in all sorts of trouble here. Guys, you never know what you're going to see in a match like this. And if you need proof of that, just go back to watch Daniel Bryan versus Kane from Extreme Rules 2014. Big reversal for her there. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane in 2014 provided scenes we ne we've seen this before. We've got a raucous crowd here in Philadelphia tonight, but what else would you expect after playing home to ECW for so many years? As we've seen in the past, Extreme Rules matches create a type of hysteria that's difficult to describe, even more difficult to contain. The shoulders are down, and she kicks out with relative ease. Not yet. I'd have to agree with what Byron's saying. When you've got action taking place all over the arena, complete with every weapon imaginable, it's not easy to keep up. Well, try, Cole. That's what you're getting paid for, isn't it? Real quick reminder, guys, there are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. Both of these competitors have so much resolve, it's going to take a minor miracle to keep one of them down. As Corey mentioned, there's a treasure trove of weapons under the ring. Everything from kendo sticks to steel chairs to fire extinguishers. If you can think about it, it's probably under there. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. We're going to be hard pressed to see a better match than that. Here's another look. That's what I love about the WWE. A match that lives up to expectations, but still finds a way to surprise us. Good stuff. That's the kind of match that makes me proud to be here at ringside. Action from the opening bell and a finish people won't soon forget. I'm not easily impressed, but that was one of the most entertaining matches I've had the pleasure to see in a while. Here is your winner, B. Tonga Ka. Took it to another level to gain that win. When you get a one-on-one 
on one match like that, you hate to see one of them come up short. But that's just the harsh reality of it. As we close the book on this match, I need to remind everybody just how big of a win this was. Simply amazing. No rest for the weary. On to the next. All bets are off as we get extreme. Making his way to the ring from Virginia, weighing in at 297 pounds, the United States Professional Champion, Mr. Cyclone Frick. As we ready for singles action, Byron, what can you tell us about these two competitors? Well, I can say that both of these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance here tonight. But as we all know, only one will walk away with their arm raised in victory.
and his opponent from Vancouver, British Columbia, weighing in at 200. The title may not be on the line tonight, guys, but still expect the same energy from the champ here in this one. Yeah, same here, Cole. I don't think the champ knows how to take it easy. That's probably why he's been so successful. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Oh, man, this is going to be great. You know, even though the title is not on the line, oh, this is man. still an important match for the champ. He can't afford to show any weakness here. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Harsh impact. Oh, nasty impact. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. At this point, it's all about how he responds and potentially Jeez. rebounds. Cross body. Oh, look at this. Neck breaker. Fireman's carry. This doesn't look good, Corey. Couldn't agree more, Cole. This has got trouble written all over it. There was a lot of force behind that one. There it is. Did you hear that crash? Oh, boy, he is rolling. Straight right to the mouth. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. There it is. Did you hear that crack? You gotta believe this.
this one's over. Expected nothing less, Cole. Oh boy, he is rolling. Integrity. Here's a cover. And his shoulder gets up in time. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. Senton connects. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. We're seeing two outstanding athletes looking to prove their dominance in there, but only one can walk out victorious. Who will it be? Now. to your advantage. Oh boy, he is rolling. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. He might have it. No part of the outside. Keep your eye on this one. Look out! Oh man! He wants. Oh, no, that's not right. Somebody do something about that. This is his opportunity to. Boom. But I don't know how much gas he has left, guys. Steal one there, perhaps. Not yet. There can only be one top dog here in the WWE, and a win here will go a long way in solidifying one of these guys' claims of being the best in the business. I think we know what this is. Comes up big with the reversal. Is he done? He breaks it. I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm going to say this, but I'm with you, Cole. So unbelievable. Table in play. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Shoulders on the mat. Not much behind that pin attempt. Yeah, this early, no chance. This might be it. Oh, my. He's not looking good here. He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. Yeah. But the good news is that he still appears to be in better condition than his opposition right now. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Oh, boy, he is rolling. And it's over kick! That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. This could do it. 
And he got a near fall out of it. How'd he do that? Oh boy, he is rolling. Chaos, melee, pin. There it is. Did you hear that crack? say when i saw this week's power rankings i thought there was a misprint there's no way this superstar deserves such a favorable ranking here we go oh, whoa. inverted power slam that should do it oh i don't like the look in his eye here folks What's this gonna be? Wheelbarrow! And face first, Flapjack! Here we go! Oh, nasty impact! Ah, here it comes, legendary! Is he done? Seen just out so far here. Wow, he escapes it. He's just got no quit in him here tonight, Cole. Right. Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Nail it. Oh my god. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. That could be it. When this guy's on, look out. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Oh, shows no mercy. And that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. This capacity crowd starting to sense the end is near. And I don't disagree. It just doesn't seem to be his night tonight, guys. I'm not sure he has much left. Let's not write him off yet. Remember, his opponent isn't necessarily whistling Dixie. Either. Oh, my God, guys. Oh, Look no. at this. Let's oh, do this. Power bomb. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. A knee drop. Close line. He's making a statement here with this attack. Looking for the exclamation point. What an incredible moonsault. This one is over. has been 
been a war. see the frustration starting to build. How'd he do that? He's a harsh impact. That is got in the cover for the win! Three! There's the pin. It's over. It's all over. Well, this is one matchup that lived up to its billing, and then some. These superstars gave him good as they got and these fans got their money's worth from the opening bell he's going to want to make sure he saves every minute of this match for his personal highlight reel because he was on Here fire winner, in this one mr cyclone Rick. what a back and forth battle that was wow when you pick up a pinfall victory over somebody like that you've done something right and it looks to me like our winner is already thinking about the next match. Always one step ahead. Things are about to heat up. Look at this. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. What a strike. Game, set, match. This one is over. Oh, He's not going to like this. Finally, the main event. Singles action coming your way. Making his way to the ring from Virginia, weighing in at 180 pounds, Negrin Butcher. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. And Michael, it sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match.
and his opponent from Grand Rapids, Michigan, weighing in at 169 pounds, Jimmy Jacobs. To a WWE's top star is ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. The WWE Universe is chopping to the bit to see these two competitors go at it. You can count me in on the excitement. I can't wait. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite some time. Golly, what a knee. Big forearm smash. This guy has plenty of fight left in him. Hey, you're gonna absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the oh. territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. I guarantee you that the post-game show on WWE Network will be talking about oh. how he struggled getting out of the gate here tonight. between the ropes. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Drop down. Just yeah. tossed. She could airline miles for that. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your traditional contest. No, it's not, Cole, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. There it is. Did you hear that crack? There it is. Did you hear that crack? They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts.
if there's any coming back from this type of assault. We might just have nothing left to give, guys. Oh, man, his family has to be concerned about him right now. He's looking banged up. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Whack. Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. He's going for it all. Incoming. Qualifications and no count outs in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Drop down. What a clothesline. Ouch. As Corey mentioned, there's a treasure trove of weapons under the ring. Everything from kendo sticks to steel chairs to fire extinguishers. If you can think about it, it's probably under there. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. In that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Oh, show no mercy. In that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Oh, show no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. to the spine. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Look out! Uh-oh. to do it. I think that slam caught us all off guard. attack 
out of that one but there's plenty more work for him to do here takes him down in a major way too I, I just can't get over the physicality of this match it has been absolutely brutal Monday night has been the premier night in all sports entertainment. And you can bet tonight will surely live up to the lofty standards. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. No question about it, Cole. Beautiful technique. He looks a bit off his game here. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. Not so fast, gentlemen. By my calculations, he's still very much winning this match. Oh, no. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him, Michael. comes he's got him across the shoulders Samoan driver just when you thought he had nothing left Superstar. Incredible victory. Hard fought matchup, and it looks like, yeah, I like that. A little sign of respect. Maybe not. What a sore loser. 